Well, hello guys, Credit Shufu has been on the road again. This time I took a trip down to DC, I had a bit over 4,000 star points left in my SPG account, and so I was asking where can I stay in DC for that price and also have free parking, since this time I was driving down there myself. The answer is nowhere. But I found a great solution. Since DC is a densely populated area, there's basically no free parking at hotels. But if you stay just outside DC, all the hotels have parking lots and the price in points is a lot lower. Since you have your own car, you can just drive into the city the next day. I found this Sheraton in Beltsville, Maryland for 4,000 star points per night. The hotel is north of DC so it actually shortens the drive down from New Jersey, something which was definitely welcome. Now, this is not a 5 star hotel, but as a convenient place to stay for one night, I certainly would give it a thumbs up. The room was spacious, with comfortable beds, the bedside table had these charging ports for your devices, very useful. There's a 32 inch TV, ice bucket, the view is not bad. Some questionable art, it seems this is the standard picture in every room. The mirror and bed head both have these cool leather finishes. There's this really cool chair for relaxing while you're drinking Starbucks coffee. All right, so we're gonna try a look. There's this Starbucks coffee, pretty good. Uh, well, I hope it's pretty good. And I couldn't find any water anywhere, so I'm just using this water from the bathroom, which kind of sucks, to be honest. So I think this is one of those ones where you just put some, uh, let's open this and see what it says. <laughs> that Sheraton has been marked down. Oh, it smells. It smells really good. Anyway, what you do is you just put it in here, like that, right? I think. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you do, you do. <laughs> and then the water, you put the water in the back. Lovely bathroom water. There we go. And then you put that there. Close that. And then you wait. No, you press on. There we go. Yeah. And uh, then you wait. All right, let's check this out. Now, they have supplied us with this, which uh, I personally think sucks. You know, why don't we just get fresh milk? I mean, everyone would be happier with that, wouldn't they? Really, to be honest. But anyway, let's try this. So we'll put, well, maybe, maybe there is some milk. Look, no, that's just all sugar. All right, coffee mate. Put that in there. And uh, oh, open up a non-dairy creamer. That's even worse. Sugar, real sugar. I don't understand why anyone would eat this, you know? It's like aspartame. It's like the excrement of genetically modified bacteria. But anyway, you know, it really is. That was released recently when the patent became public Monsanto aspartame anyway right let's do this and check it out Starbucks coffee pipe place is reasonably good let's try it mm, it's actually not bad okay so this is the room service let's check this out oh yeah that looks good room service was tasty and also cheap but I asked for a medium burger, it came out well done. Amateurs. Still good though. The bathroom is also not bad at all with everything you need and some things that you, well, really don't need. <laughs> anyway, there are a few things I didn't like. For example, this microwave on top of the fridge looks really cluttered. And there's another thing. One thing that's kind of annoying me is I was sitting here Right, and uh, then I looked down, and I saw this. Like, what the? I mean, this really doesn't belong inside a nice hotel. Room. You know what I mean? This looks like it should be outside, where people can just throw trash into it, or it should be in like a garbage room or something like that. It, you know, you would think in a hotel room it would have like a leather exterior and a bag and so anyway, whatever. That's just a little bit of a. You know, this marks the room down one point for me. You know, really. What do you think? Not good, right? Nah. No. <laughs> but all in all, I would give this hotel good marks. We have to remember, it's only a three-star hotel. Well, technically three and a half, but I say that's still three. 
And within the range of three star hotels, I would say it's a really good option. And for 4,000 star points a night, it's a bargain. Sure, you could stay in luxury at the W just minutes from the White House, but that would cost you 20,000 star points per night, plus parking fees. At the Sheraton in Beltsville, you can stay in relative comfort, park your car for free, and still drive in and meditate on the power of American freedom at the National Mall the next day. What more could you ask for? And all for a mere 4,000 star points. Anyway, maybe we'll check out the W next time, once my SPG balance has built up again. What do you think of this hotel, guys? Leave your comments below, and please subscribe for more videos like this every couple of days. See you next time.